church family. Today's reading is from Hebrews chapter 13 verse 16 and is taken from the New Living Translation. And don't forget to do good and to share with those in need. These are the sacrifices that please God. Elsewhere it is written that we are to do good to all, especially to those who are of the faith. I was thinking, given the recent challenges we've all faced due to COVID, government austerity measures, and now this financial crisis, this cost of living crisis, we've, all, we've been witnesses to all manner of sufferings, many of which have been very close to home. One of our five commitments is a call to serve, to serve one another, to serve our community, our communities and beyond. We all know this can be a, quite a challenge and we know it both requires time and sacrifice. For some of us, it may mean reprioritizing or making some necessary adjustments in order for us to serve in such a way. It may be laying aside this, that or the other. And they're not necessarily bad or unhealthy, um, yet they rob God of our time, of our, of our service, of our calling, and of our money. These minor or major adjustments will of course look differently for each of us. And we don't need to feel condemned if we feel we fall short in any way, as God knows our hearts. And he doesn't condemn his children. Therefore, I want to encourage us with these words from Psalm 127, verse 7. Again, reading from the New Living Translation. Unless the Lord builds a house, the work of the builders will be wasted. Unless the Lord builds the house, the work of the builders will be wasted. I would like us, in light of this passage of Scripture, to Focus our attention on the Lord, that it would be for us to earnestly seek him, desire him and inquire of him as to how he would have us serve in this new season. To serve the community, to serve one another, to serve the community that we live in here in Stratton Baptist and the communities in which we find ourselves each and every day and further afield of course. So, with that, let us pray. Heavenly Father, we ask you in Jesus' name to help us to take these words to heart, to think upon them, and to ask and inquire of you how you would have us serve in this new season. Thank you, Heavenly Father, for those who have been serving faithfully for such a long time in all manner of ways. We thank you for their faithful service and we pray that they will continue to serve in such a way. May we all be encouraged by, by you as we look at Jesus Christ as the perfect example of servanthood. To serve one another, to serve our communities and to serve further beyond as you would lead us by your spirit. And we ask these things in Jesus' name.